Welcome to our two minute tech trend. My name is Laura Dravik and I'm the chief evangelist at Guidewire. Chatbot or conversational AI are computer programs that interface with a human to mimic a conversation. Looping back to Omnichannel, they are also another customer service option that can enable service anytime, anywhere. When speaking with our customers, carriers want to leverage chatbots to perform high volume, low complexity transactions and free up the human to focus on more complex activities that require human intelligence and empathy. Things like frequently asked questions like, am I covered? Or how much do I owe? Or doing a simple transaction like a simple first notice of loss. Chatbots don't replace the human, they supplement them. In a customer service context, you can think of a chatbot in three components. Number one is the interface between the chatbot and the human through a messaging app like Facebook Messenger or a chat session on a company's website. Increasingly, the UI uses spoken voice, for example, Siri or Alexa. The intelligence allows the chatbot to understand and solve customer queries and to learn from each interaction. And third, the integration is with other systems and platforms, including integration with workforce management systems to access human agents when the chatbot can't actually answer the question. If you want to see a chatbot in action, watch this video of what we created for first notice of loss using Facebook Messenger. Hi, I'm Laura. Let me tell you about my good bad day. I was leaving work, texting with my husband on Facebook Messenger, and as I approached my new car, I smelled paint. Someone had tagged it with red spray paint. I couldn't believe it. My insurer is on Facebook Messenger too, so I texted them and they answered right away. They asked if this was an emergency situation and I said no, and then they verified my phone number. They wanted to know when the loss occurred and because the spray paint was still wet, I told them now. When they checked my policy, they realized that this is an amazing brand new car and they were very sympathetic about it. They asked what had happened and I selected vandalism. They wanted to know where it happened too, so I pinpointed my exact location. The next part was kind of fun. They asked if I could take a quick video of myself explaining what had happened, so I did it and then I uploaded the video. The last thing they asked for was a photo of the damage, which was great because it gave me the chance to show them just how bad my car looked. They responded quickly with all of the claim information that I had given to them and asked me to verify the details. I simply hit yes, and I confirm, and it was done. They told me that they were on it, and you know what? They kept their promise. My claim was settled quickly, they sent me to a fantastic repair shop, and my car looks brand new again. So this was my good bad day.